What is up, guys? I'm back with another food review. Now, I'm back with another vending machine item from my new job, and it's uh, AVI Food Systems. Now, I did the pizza burger because that was interesting, and anything to do with pizza, I am down. I want to try everything that has to do with pizza. I love pizza. I'm a pizza-aholic. So, I found pizza sub. Pizza sub. Now, what's really crazy with this is when I get my pizzas from, like, you know, Domino's, Pizza Hut, you know, Pop John's, any place, okay? So, when I get my pizza, I always get extra sauce, pepperoni, banana peppers. Now, what really caught me off guard is the fact when I looked inside there and I was like, oh, pizza sub, I kind of want to try it, but, you know, it screamed my name. Why did it scream my name? The fact that it actually has banana peppers in it. That's crazy. So, it's got pepperoni and banana peppers. It's calling my name. I got to try it out. So, here we are. So, pizza sub with homemade sauce from AVI Food Systems. Let's try this beast. So, all you do is just, you open up one end and you throw it in a microwave for 30 seconds and boom, you're done. So, let's try it out. What it looks like. One side's got more than the other side. Like, if you look at it. So, we'll try both ends, I guess. Next bite, we'll actually get into some of that cheese, finally. Here we go. Okay. Okay. I do have to say, that's a lot better than I thought it would be. Now, I could be mistaken, but I want to say that I paid $1.50 for this, out of the vending machine. But, wow, wow. Wow. Even their little plate that it puts on it says the what you call it the ABI, yeah, ABI. That's really good, man. For real, it's got a little spice to it too. I don't know if it's a sauce or just the peppers. Really good. Really, really good. I definitely get this again. To me, it needs a little extra cheese on it. But, yeah, it's the peppers, the peppers, the sauce. The sauce, I guess, is mild.
yeah, the sauce is mild. It's got a little heat to it, but it's not that bad. It's a little spice, like black peppery. But those peppers, those peppers are not, they're not regular banana peppers. You know how you get the mild ones on your pizza? This is like medium style, man. So it's got a little punch. Definitely. It's got a little kick. So on a heat spectrum, I'd say like one to five. Or I'd say this is like a two and a half. It burns a little bit. I can feel it still. But pizza quality, I mean, you're making a sub pizza style. Or you're making a pizza a sub style. Whatever you want to say. Point being is, it definitely, it tastes like a pizza. It tastes like a pizza. It definitely tastes like a pizza. I like it. I mean, just a little more cheese and it'd be awesome. So with that said, I would say... For what it is, I mean, you're getting out of a vending machine and you're nuking it for only 30 seconds. Definitely a nine. Nine, nine and a half. Definitely. Yeah, nine and a half. Give it a nine and a half. Why not? It's good. I would get this again. Like, if I had it at home, like I do right now i would definitely put a little bit more cheese on there and just throw it in there oh that would make it a 10 for real it does not taste processed it tastes banging so yeah there you go nine and a half another view in the books another day another dollar y'all peace